One of the things that really interested me when the Ram TRX was announced was the air intake system because it's ginormous. It's like four times the capacity as far as uh, air filters uh, than any nearest competitor. Uh, and it can push water out. Uh, it has a really cool intake system where air is fed in from both right below the hood and then through the hood into uh, the, you know, through the scoop and into the intake from above. So you've got air coming from above and air coming from below, and then you've got this box below the filters that has uh, um, uh, baffles built into it, and it pushes anything, like the, the, the dirt doesn't usually, I mean, that's gonna get caught by the filters, but when the water gets through, it's designed so that the pressure from the air coming from the two different places pushes it out through a, uh, a drain that's in the, uh, the left side of the intake. So I wanted to take it apart and see exactly what it looked like and how it, how it ticked. So uh, I did so and I'll show you now. The air comes in through here. So you've got some air that comes in and there's a pathway into the intake from uh, behind the grill and then you've got air forced in through this scoop. Now, I already actually sort of took it apart. Uh, to make this easier, but basically you've got this cover. Sorry, I'm working on my camera work here. That, uh, I mean, it clips off. I had it off already. And then you've got this awesome Easter egg of a T-Rex eating a raptor. So I'll set this cover aside. And then there are, I think 10, 10 of these screws and those come out. Also the, uh, the intake elbow needs to be loosened. So then you, you pop this off. Now you've got the air filters, which that's a pretty large surface area. And these just slide out like that if you ever need to clean them or replace them. And now you can see the system. So you've got air that gets pushed in through here and it's pushing the, the debris in the water, mostly the water, into this drain right here. And then you've got air coming in from there. So you've got a high air and kind of a, a lower air and they have it engineered so that the pressure pushes any water to this drain right here, which just drains below that pan. And I thought it was a cool setup and it sealed really well. Like I've, I've taken this through a bunch of mud and uh, fields and you can see some of the water trail from there but other than that, like the filters are super clean. When I took that cover off right there, you see there was some dirt under there, but uh, all that is is a cover. This is the, the top piece of the intake and it got dirty, but really not much mud came through. I can't say the same for the engine. The engine got uh, a little dirty. Anyways. That's it, that's the intake. I thought it was a really cool piece of engineering and uh, thought you guys would thought you guys would dig it. Yeah. Innovation.